I want to give you some updates on Rosa Salazar and on the Magan Awards. I'm pronouncing that wrong. I know I am. Um, turns out she didn't win. Um, Isabella Mon Moner, I believe that's how you say her name. She won. And I just recently saw Dora in the Golden City or whatever it's called, the Dora movie. I saw that over the weekend with my daughter and we both enjoyed it. Um, I think, yeah, the best part of it was Elizabeth Moner. The, uh, she wasn't nominated for that movie, but that was my first experience with her and my first exposure to her. So I, I would have to say, you know what, um, I haven't seen the movie that she was actually nominated for, but I did like her in the Dora movie. So I had to give her props for that. You know, congratulations to her to Elizabeth Moner. And um, even though Rosa Salazar didn't win, but you know, to us, to Elite Army, she's still queen. So we can't take anything um, away from her either. So congratulations again to Elizabeth Moner on her win for Best Actress. And I believe the movie was titled um, Instant Family. That's what it is, Instant Family. So there's another thing that I would like to talk about as well regarding uh, Rosa Salazar. This is just going to be a brief, really brief update. She has uh, deleted her, well, not maybe deleted, but she has de deactivated her Instagram. And uh, people don't need to worry about that. I think it's something that they said Rosa Salazar has done before. And not only that, but sometimes uh, who knows what's going on behind the scenes. It could be good it could be bad uh, it could be that with i think i think uh what's her name kelly marie tran did the same thing once and people try to say she was uh harassed off of offline but i think you know sometimes actors and actresses just have to go offline in order to um just get away from social media sometimes <laughs> which is not a bad thing and also because sometimes they may be uh working on a movie and they have to keep you know, maybe, maybe they have a no social media, uh, what do you call it, mandate. But what's happened in, in Rosa's absence, she's, she's taken down her Instagram account, which was called um, Rosa Salazar. It was just plain old Rosa Salazar. What happened was that the imposter that was on Twitter has stepped up in, in her place and is posing as Rosa Salazar now. And we know this is the imposter from Twitter because um, it says right there that person lists as their Twitter real Rosa Salazar. And Rosa Salazar has came out already and said that she does not have another social media account and especially not on Twitter because she hates Twitter. I'm going to get that screenshot for you. All right, here it is. Um, I took this screenshot a while back before uh, this was just a temporary, this was right after Rosa had did her interview with, I can't remember exact, exactly what the outlet was, but she was doing her tour for Undone around the San Diego Comic-Con, and they had put up on the screen uh, Real Rosa Salazar on Twitter, and immediately after that, I believe she found, she saw that, and she changed her Instagram account to say, um, I have no other social media accounts, I especially hate Twitter. And if you'll notice that she has a blue check mark um, by her name, and this fake Rosa Salazar account does not have any blue check mark, uh, not on Twitter and not on Instagram. But this is the real Rosa Salazar, and since then she's changed her uh, account name to say once again the Battle Angel. Thankfully, <laughs> because she is our Battle Angel, and so we really appreciate her uh, calling herself the Battle Angel. But that's it, you know. She's right now, she's not on Instagram. She took it down. And the other account that's up there right now called Rosa Salazar Real is an imposter. And the, I don't know, social media allows it. They don't do anything about it. And this is probably very frustrating to Rosa, but there doesn't appear to be anything that we can do about it. We've already tried reporting the account on Twitter and Twitter hasn't done anything. So, uh, well, that's, that's pretty much it. So anyway, thank you all for um, listening to this update.